What is sportsmanship? Welcome to the Racing Etiquette. In this section, you will be learning about sportsmanship, an important element in everyone's participation in the online races of Gran Turismo. The history of sports is as old as human history, and the definition of sports is said to be as numerous as there are researchers in the field. But when you get to the bottom of it, a sport is a challenge against yourself, a challenge against a rival, and above all else is something to enjoy and have fun with. A sport is something you enjoy together with others. For this, there is sportsmanship, the attitude you must have when you partake in a sport. So what is sportsmanship? Everyone knows that all sports have rules. And of course one element of sports is that you must follow the rules. But even if you set lots of detailed rules, you can't judge all incidents during an actual sport just with rules. That's where sportsmanship becomes important. Sportsmanship can also be called the spirit of fair play. And in addition to being fair and just, sportsmanship also means that you don't do things that make you look bad. To avoid doing things to anyone that makes you look bad. That's the core idea behind sportsmanship that is beyond rules. Motorsport is called a non-contact sport. That means it is a sport which does absolutely not allow contact with others. But in order to achieve this, it is not enough to have a strict set of rules. It is extremely important that everyone works to avoid doing things that make you look bad. Two, various improper driving examples. Here we will introduce some examples of improper driving and driving that makes you look bad. First of all, weaving back and forth to block the path of other cars is prohibited. Also, pushing others Edging out others, pushing others off the track. When you are late on the brakes, it is not considered well-mannered driving. Overshooting a corner because you braked too late and failed to turn because you were too anxious to overtake your opponent. This is an example of driving that really makes you look bad. The worst is when you become a missile by not being able to stop within the track, ramming into other cars and ruining the race for others as well as yourself. Even if you initially had an understanding of all this in your head, if you become too overzealous in the race and ended up braking too late and you are about to hit the car ahead of you, not only should you hit your brakes, you should avoid hitting the car ahead at all cost even if that means taking your car off the track. This type of driving mistake often happens when you are a beginner. So starting out, just be careful. Avoid interfering with others and start by assessing the situation and you will start to see and be aware of your surroundings. And finally, how can you protect yourself from these types of accidents? During a race, it is not easy to communicate your intent with other drivers, but by monitoring the other cars around you, you will start to understand the tendencies of each car and driver, as well as their skills. If you feel that a certain driver seems a bit dangerous, or that a certain car is not used to racing yet, rethink and reposition yourself on the track, so that you can avoid being involved in the chaos that they may cause.